Keep out. Packets and groceries delivery. Whistle two times, leave delivery on doormat, and exit the area. No advertisements. Beverly, my image of this innocent place has been tainted. I found a trash dump right in the middle of these woods, probably long established by the locals. The question arises, who would sink so low? A voluptuous pear tree. These fruits are mine to pick up. The perfect spot for a bench. Gotcha! This is private property, and you're obviously on my turf. This time, boy, you've chosen the wrong neighborhood. I'm selling these fine massage rods. <sighs> Didn't you read the sign? Signs? Which signs? <sighs> Very funny. You're one of them. I know. Confess. One of them? Oh, no. Not again. Okay, I'll tell you once and for all, I'm not an alien. I don't care what you believe. A what? An alien? <laughs> now you think you've been clever, don't you? No, sir. And just in case you want me to take part in any tests, let me tell you. You government guys are getting more and more annoying. Wait, government guys? I already told you guys last time, not on my watch. Name and rank, soldier. You're with the uh, CIA, BND, HVA, FBI, NSA. Spit it out! Name's Tannhauser. I'm a quantum physicist on vacation. Liar! That's ridiculous! You better tell me the truth, or else... Say something! Nice hat. Okay, I guess you're right. The quality of your lies doesn't imply a higher intelligence at work. Quite the opposite, in fact. So, what are you doing here anyway? The truth this time, the whole story! Well, it all began a few weeks ago, when I got this notification that said I won a trip to Europe. I was stunned, but Aunt Lottie gave her blessings. A prize like this should not be forfeited, she said. I might even be able to discover some distant relatives. Also, that I deserved a break. She only wished for me to return safe and sound. So, after a brief visit to Berlin, I began my journey. And that's how I ended up here. Interesting story. I mean, it's ridiculous, but I'm inclined to believe you. Now, about the part with the Millennium Cooperative. I always had the impression that something wasn't quite right with them. Well then, bye. Feel free to visit me anytime. We can go into all the details. Name's Lessing, by the way.
This windmill provides electricity to the treehouse. Autonomous and sustainable. Special Agent Hans Tannhauser. I'm with the FBI. <laughs> Very. What do you know about the Millennium Cooperative? I know they're a bunch of powerful people. A secret society, like the Freemasons or the uh, Illuminati. They surely build something fishy up the... Ever heard the term Saturn portal? Of course. In theory, the Saturn portal describes a kind of interdimensional opening, a gate to the stars, like a crossroads or a... That sounds familiar. That sure sounds a lot like science fiction to me. Well, it's all arcane theoretical physics. Blending modern science with occult magic. They are trying to establish a connection to the southern pole of Sparkland current. They flow through the Earth in form of an electric plot to free if you look at the northern... What's with your squirrel? That's drowsy. He's me friend. Sleepy fella. So why are you living out here on your own? The government obviously... So they declared me insane. Back in the days when it used to be a real cemetery. When things went down the drain, I realized that people like me have no place in a society like this. People like me have to disappear. Go undercover. We have to resist until our day comes. Crikey, you must have been down the deepest depths of the rabbit hole. Of course I have. If you look at the ancient Sumerian and Babylonian writings, you will see a... Ah! You hear that hum? Stop it. Make it stop. Stop, stop, stop. It's them! They try to slowly drive me insane with their atomic radiation! I think I've heard enough. Nice talking to you. Feel free to visit me any The landscape vaguely reminds me of home. Detailed blueprints for a bunker layout. Odd. I'd rather not sniff around. Self-defense. It's a base tuba. No way. Brass is my kryptonite. And contact allergies are nothing to joke about. This light bulb is wind-powered. 100% clean energy. That's a pretty deep... Hey, sweetheart. Good evening. I'll be leaving. It's much too cold. I just need a moment to reach. How are you holding up? Don't worry about it. You don't look so good. Sorry I said that. No, it's cool, really. I get that a lot. About the quantum discriminator. Yes? 
I totally lost track. Take a look at these. We need a power source. As if this was my dimension, I'd recommend using one of the. I'm afraid that's not. Whew. We do need a particle. Has to be small enough. A brown tube, maybe. From it could work. I just had an idea. And a keyboard. I understand. And a really potent coolant. What do you have? Water won't do. Okay. They're having a blast. An empty jar. That's a prototype of the Valentine. A gift from a friend. An ectoplasm interference oscillator. Interphasic coil spanner. Gasoline powder. It's an excerpt of the Tonklin diary. I don't even know where to begin. Don't worry. Now nah. that the this is hot. Truda. Hello, Professor. I'll be leaving. Make it. There's a brown tube inside. I could use it for the quantum discriminator. The kid will be traumatized for her entire life if I just disassemble her only friend. I don't think I can do this. She's back in her parallel universe. Their collective weight is almost breaking the antenna. This bucket seems to have been hung here for purely decorative. A brand new episode of Hey, sweetheart. Good evening. I'll be... A swarm of fireflies is gathering around the broken streetlight. Maybe they think it's their god.
Hey, sweetheart. Good evening. I'll... Patience. The mere thought of cotton candy. I'm not going to... I have to insert a coin first. If I return to the This should suffice for a paddle wheel. You fixed the boat! How can I- Don't worry. No, 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 I insist. Please take this as a si This postcard will help me find my way around. Uh, thanks. Ahoy.
The woods surrounding Trubberbrook emanate a dreary sense of blandness. I've rarely ever been engulfed in a more terrifying, dreadful environment. Not to mention there is a green glow spreading through the Fenwoods. Interesting. No trespassing. Sensational discovery. Signed, the Paleontological Society of Kribber Brook. <coughs> Beverly, I now stand right in front of the legendary Trubber Brook specimen. This close, I find it all the less surprising people here have cultivated the myth of a sea monster. He won't be needing these anymore. They did their job. Or did they? Excuse me, sir. Beverly. I took a paddle boat and ventured forth towards the final frontier of this region, a forlorn swamp of ancient origin. On my way, I came across the mortal shell of a lost wanderer. Whether he was led astray by a wisp or fell victim to this region's mythical beast, the hook elf, remains a mystery to be disentangled. I can only hope to be spared of such misfortune. them from here. Oh, I'm not feeling too well. Something's glowing green. Let's see if he had anything on him. Only if it helps to clear his identity, of course. An old rusty key. Good idea, Hans. Good idea, Hans, but that doesn't work at all. Better stick to the road, as gr Look who we've got here. I see you're making good use of those boots. These boots are made for walking. Thanks again. My pleasure. You're looking a bit pale, if I may say so. Here, have one of these. They always work for me. Vitamin pills? Si, claro. They get the juices flowing and make you look gorgeous. All based on herbal essences. Thanks. Uh... I have to be going. See you later. No way I'm ever... I'm not in the mood for a snack.
I'm not so sure about that. Sanatorium pair of beauty. I'm not so Sanatorium. Truda? Hello. I would... Oh, yes, of... What can you tell me about your brother? He's a drunkard. As you see, he's just left me here alone with all this work that needs to be... Can you give me a description? Should you run into him? Is that why you are asking? Tall grown, beardy type, always wearing those yellow rubber boots. Why do you want to know? I think I may have met him. I found his mortal remains out there in the mire. I'm sorry. Uh, are you sure? My condolences. Oh, Heinz. Poor old Heinz. Rest in peace. Can't say I'm really surprised. Thank you very much. I will inform the... At least he didn't take the long... Would you mind... Come again? My... Your... Never mind. Uh, oh, yes. Ah. Uh, Make yourself... Perfect fit. Beverly, I have unearthed the gate to a sealed crypt, the cellar of this lodge. My descent begins. This is what Professor Lidenbrock must have felt when he climbed down the Snifels, Yukul. I can hardly see a thing. Light the way, my friends. Trubberbrook's finest dry yeast. Malt? It's a recipe for Bolton Schuss Schnapps. Top secret. Let's see. Fruit, add malt, add yeast, season with a pinch of slumber morale. Dead simple. Fire making first. I need to find a way to ignite the gas.
No way I'm ever going back in there again. I'm not so sure about that. I can't reach them from here. I can probably walk on water with this. As grab Excuse me, sir. Step right up, Mr. Moine. Right, all right. That was, ooh, not so bad. Just between the two of us. You could use a little dose of vitamins, don't you think? Always remember, a healthy body equals a healthy mind. Something's glowing green. Something's...
intruder. Hello, Professor. I would like. Oh yes, of course. Got a lot. Sure. Ah. I. Oh yes. Of ah. I'll be. Make your. I can hardly see a thing. Light the way, my friends. Fire making first. The recipe mentions fruit to be fermented. Only one more ingredient. If only I had slumber morels like they mention in the recipe. If only I had slum. Truda? Hello, Professor. I would like to. Oh, yes, of. Ah. I'll make. Ahoy! I can hardly see a thing. Light the way, my friends. If only... I can hardly see a thing. Light the way, my friends.
Ahoj. I can hardly see a thing. Light the way, my friends. Yikes! I'm going to take a sample for science. Whoa, that is some mean spirit. Alcohol? Never again. Wasn't I carrying some cool gadgets in my pockets earlier? God bless, what's this? Did you ever see the likes of it? What's going on? Where are you heading? No time to lose. Don't you see the cold front? I have to go to the weather station. There's a weather station here? <laughs> well, yes. Don't be silly. What was that? This one is on you, boys. Oaks and jo End of the world or not, I can't miss this gig. They're still playing their sad song.
band. They're still playing their sad song. The band. the band. The band. The band, they're still playing their sad song. They won't be needing this anymore. Perfect, an important component of the quantum discriminator. Truda? Hello, Professor. I oh, yes, of course. Ah. I'll make it. That should work. Neat. That's a good start, isn't it? Three pieces left. Right, another pinch of calcium?
There is no bad weather, only the wrong clothes. I wholeheartedly have to agree with this saying, Beverly. I am standing on top of the Klumpen, apparently the highest elevation within the surrounding low mountain range. If you wanted to, you could describe the clothes that I'm wearing as perfectly unfit for the current weather conditions. After a short walk, I have reached the local weather station. In Trevorbrook, up on the Klumpen top, the art of meteorology is in full swing. The current microclimatic developments in this area seem to have sparked scientific interest. Now this looks coat. It's merely a conventional weather balloon, not a flying saucer. It's a tank, most likely full of helium. The tower hosts an impressive array of measuring devices. Hello? Good morning. I didn't see you at all. Uh, please excuse the frosty welcome. Madonna Lucke, I'm with the Meteorological Society. Tannhauser, my pleasure. So what are you doing here? I'm observing. So anything interesting about the weather? Hmm. Well, actually I'm in Trüberbrook because the weather here is so inconspicuous. Quite your status. But this afternoon I was thunderstruck. The ordinariness has disappeared. And now the ice is cracking under your feet? Exactly. And I'm in a haze hole that's even possible. It's dawning on me what you're trying to say. So what's... Just look. I just come out when thunder... The farmhand on the maiden stumbles. Oh, come on, that's... Okay, September. Brings icy soil that's hard to plow? Yes, that... For how long? In Trüberbrook, the project. I'll be... Of course. I prefer to remain on solid ground in this kind of weather. I prefer to remain on solid ground in this kind of... Pardon me. Is that helium in your tank by any chance? Exactly. To fill the weather balloons. Hey, please don't steal my helium. Hello? I don't want to... Could I... Sp well, what exactly... I want to use it as a coolant. As a coolant? You would need to lower its temperature until it... I think it'll work out all right. Believe me. After all. So... Uh, I can provide... Would you mind venturing down? I can't... No, I'm sitting here. And then... Aurora Borealis in Trüberbrook.
In the name of academic merits, I have to help you. The guest house down in the village has a telegram. I'll try to... Uh, Tana. <laughs> Hello. I'd like to this on behalf of the meteor. Oh yes, of shoot. Um. Zero, seven, two, zero, four. One, zero, two, four, one, seven, two. Oh, that did. Hmm. Guess I haven't remembered. Truda. Oh. Truda. Hello. I'd like to on behalf. Oh, yeah. Shoot. Um. Zero. One, zero, four, three, three. Two, two, six, zero, eight. Four, zero, zero, one, eight.
Oh, that didn't take long for an answer. Let me read it to you. Data inconclusive. Stop. Please verify all data. Stop. Sensational. Stop. Thank you, Truda. I will deliver the message at once. Hello? Good morning. Here's the data in please ver sensation. A sense that just here they are, please. Where are these stations of yours? Well, there's one by the lake, another one in the village near the lookout, and the third is far out in the swamps. All right. <sighs> Tannhauser. Mr. T Hello? Good. Where are these stations? Another one in the village near the and the third. All right. <sighs> Tannhauser. Hey, please don't steal my helium. I bet she doesn't come out here on a regular basis. Let's see. Wind direction, temperature? Two more weather. Let's see. Wind or temperature? High. Hello? Good morning. I think I've got... Oh, that's incredible. Can you smell the Nobel Prize? I've got to take a closer look. But... Oh, yes. Keep the helium. Take as much as you want. Filled with gas. Perfect.
Over here, little birdies. Whoops, I must have overfed them. Get lost, you wet blankets. Great idea. That's it. We're halfway through. Only two pieces and counting. Core temperature at 15 million degrees Fahrenheit. Check. Step right up! Wow, not too bad. Not too bad at all. I think we have a new champion. 
Congratulations! Here, this is your prize. A leaden trophy. Like a trophy made out of lead. This one's a real beauty! Thanks. This bucket seems to have been hung here for purely decorative reasons. Don't worry. Now, the quest projecting a then to put that the portal a rift. A this is I. How are you holding up? Don't worry. About the quest. Yes, I totally lost. Take a look. We need a. If this was my dad, I'm afraid. Whew. We do need. Has to be small enough to fit a brown tube, maybe. From a TV set? Could work. I just... An interface to control the... I think this accordion will do the trick. Does it hit... And a really potent coolant. It Good thinking. Cool. Okay. 